effects on surgery and clinical outcome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon. My name is Sebastian Ille. I'm a neurosurgical resident at the Department of Neurosurgery in Munich. And I thank you for giving me the opportunity to present our results regarding the resection of brain tumors with or without uh, support of a neuropsychologist. I think we don't have to discuss here that direct cortical or direct electrical stimulation during a craniotomy is the gold standard for language mapping during the resection of brain tumors. But you can do this with or without um, uh, the help of a neuropsychologist. And up to now, there's no data um, which show us the effect on the clinical outcome and the surgery itself. We therefore analyzed 68 consecutive patients who underwent awake craniotomy for resection of left-sided uh, brain tumors. 54 of them were with a neuropsychologist present, and 14 resections were performed without a neuropsychologist. And these 14 cases were due to language barriers between a neuropsychologist and um, the, the patient. So, for example, Russian patients. We uh, created two groups, one group with neuropsychological support and one without. And in the group without neuropsychological support, um, there was whether a bilingual resident or another translator there during operation. Both groups were highly comparable regarding a number of patients, uh, not regarding the number of patients, but regarding the age, gender, and histology. And these are our results. Regarding the extent of resection, we can find on the y-axis, it's the gross total resection in percent. And there are the two groups. We could find a higher rate of gross total resections with a neuropsychologist present than what is obviously um, the, the duration of surgery. The duration of surgery was shorter when there was a neuropsychologist present. And regarding surgery-related uh, new language deficits, we could find um, uh, less surgery-related language deficits when we performed a wake craniotomy with the support of a neuropsychologist. So due to these results, we came to the conclusion that a neuropsychologist is essential during uh, awake surgery for language eloquent tumors. And in the first instance, we made this study or we analyzed these patients to reason the reimbursement of a, a neuropsychologist in some departments, because, for example, in Germany, this could be a problem. Thank you for your attention. Thanks very much. Do you mind taking a seat with us? Thank you very much. I would like to ask the following speaker, that is Dr. Van Eerschott.